Hello, this is H.G. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Royal Stone! Last time, we made it to the Kingdom of Barra, where I guess all these guys are floaty ghosts or something or other. There's nothing in any of the houses. They're all either abandoned or you can't get in there to begin with anyway. So, yeah, there's nothing useful we can do here. No shopping or, or anything like that. We'll have to wait for the next town for that. Okay, how's it going? Who are you talking to? You got like a portal or a teleportation pad or something? I don't know. Yeah, kind of dead. Kind of hard to help you with that. Well, you're already dead, so, I mean, how much worse could it possibly get? But I've already thrown my life away on more than one occasion. No, I'm the ghost of Christmas future. No! I Yeah, of course, he's a king. There's ghost of Christmas present. Yeah, they kind of killed everyone with, uh, I don't know, day-affected nethocyte or something? Or, well, basically the same thing. Well, we've only got one stone. What do you want me to do about it? What does foment mean? Is that a real word? Maybe it was a typo in the translation. I don't know. I've never heard that word before. My vocabulary is somewhat limited. Uther Pendragon? No. Oh, I guess that's where uh, General Tor came from, huh? Oh, so he's the guy in charge. Well, the na Empire is named after him. Shouldn't that be obvious? What do you mean? He just wants to take over the world. How complicated could it possibly be? Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Sounds familiar. Nah, it's probably not important. I think you're just being paranoid. Pay no attention to his rambling spheres. Well, Ava's been doing a pretty good job. Yeah, kicking ass and taking names. What more do you want? So be it. How are you giving to that to us if we're dead? Or you're dead? Maybe we're already dead and we're trying to reclaim our lives through victory. Victory is life. Oh. What, it, what does it do? I don't think they ever explain what that thing does. It's just, here's a magic item and it'll take you there somehow or... Whatever. I guess you're not meant to really think about it too much. There is no Ava, only Zoo. Whatever that is, but... Yeah, okay, let's get going. Then. Okay, so, same party as always. I'd like to try and focus on leveling up my Griffin and Ava during this fight. Oh, yeah, there's uh, Luminette. How's it going? Yeah, she was still kind of out there. Uh-oh. Are they going to try and recruit her? What do you mean? You beat up, uh... Sora long ago. What do you mean? Oh, yeah, he was kind of posing as the, uh... 
uh, was it the Duke for a while, so yeah, he would kind of know her, maybe. Uh oh. Nuts. Even if we win, what are we gonna do then? I mean, let's just say we overthrow the Empire or whatever. I mean, all the kingdoms are kind of gone. Seems like they've, the Empire's pretty much taken over the world already. I mean, they want to throw the world into chaos, but with who? I mean, it takes two to start a fight. Oh, he's the Earl, not the Duke. Okay, never mind. I get all those ranks mis mixed up. Hmm? Oh, yeah, the, uh, what is it? Leo, I think he's talking about. What do you mean? What? Did you take control of Ava or something? No. Oh. Well, now you know the truth, Luminette. You are going to uh, accept it now, right? And stop trying to kill me? that it doesn't really matter. Yeah, why didn't she do that? I guess maybe she didn't want... Well, probably figured no one would believe her. Not to mention, I don't know, maybe she didn't want to just uh, ruin her adopted father's name or something. Weren't you doing it covertly? Oh, you don't seem like you're doing too well, Luminette. Yeah, we kind of kicked her ass a little too hard the last... How many times have we fought her? Twice? Something like that. Yep. And if I don't? I mean, if you kill her, then you don't get anything out of it. And if she does tell... Or, yeah. If she does tell you, you're just gonna kill her anyway. And just strengthen my resolve. So. Kind of creepy without battle music here. I just like the music here. Didn't we already do that? Man, what a horrible end for her. Oh, okay, they do explain what it does. You just fly up there, I guess. not too far away. This battle's actually pretty easy. I mean, they are fairly high level, but still. Yeah, most of these guys are going to... Well, actually, they got a pretty... Uh, yeah, they got a pretty even spread between all the enemy... All the elements. I got a few wind, water, and fire guys there. So, okay, first things first, let's start scanning them to figure out what we're up against. Okay, thank you.
If I can get the bishops up to max level, that would be nice. But like I said, uh, Ava, Griffin, they're going to be my uh, main priorities. I would like to try and finish off Griffin so that I can have him equipped on my evoker there. Along with all the other stuff. Maybe get my other melee fighters up to level 12 or something. Yeah, level 12 ought to be good enough. If you weren't using monsters, you'd probably be up to max level for everyone by now, or pretty close to it. That's what I did in my uh, first playthrough of the game. Pretty much just brute force killed all the enemies. With uh, melee fighters and a couple... I, I upgraded both my... Magi to wizards. Yeah, I pretty much just used the same party that I did in Crystal Warriors. And, uh, yeah, that gets the job done. Probably the best way to go, but I like using monsters. Even if they're not absolutely the end-all, be-all. Ah. Now, you want to be careful here, because they got all those different elements available to them. So, just kind of black that off. I'm going to try and put Ava and my two bishops up front. That way they can't really exploit any elemental weaknesses. Okay, I'm guessing those three are all fire elemental, but even so. Uh, okay, let's put you there. And, yeah, we'll scan those two. Losers. Losers! Um, hmm. You know, now that I got my, uh, wizard up front, let's, uh, put her to use. Let's see, I'm gonna assume that that's a water elemental. Oh, okay. I didn't think they'd mix them up like that. Well, we got a little bit. I mean, better than nothing. I would have just scanned if I didn't do that anyway. Okay, let's see. Ava. There we go. Yeah, all these guys are melee fighters. They don't have any healers, bishops, or wizards, or magi. So, yeah, that helps us out a lot here. Keep the wall up there. That way they can't break through. Maybe I should have put one of my... Er, well, my one evoker up there. Oh, well. Not the end of the world. How are you doing there? Um, if those are all fire guys, then... Yeah, they are all fire guys. So, let's see. You know what? Let's uh, start softening you up a little bit. I'll play it a little risky. Why not? Mm, not bad, not bad. Uh, let's see. Let's, uh, just run away. Maybe I should have just used a regular physical, but... Okay, whatever. And let's get you up top. Kill all those other guys first. Probably with Ava. I really want to get her up to max level. Because she gets a massive stat boost for doing that. Ow, put it. Well, that actually hurt a bit. Um, yeah, let's go with boost. Not that I really need that much power, but I don't want to risk uh, killing the guy. Or only knocking him down to critical, and then he'll defend. Overkill. Now oh, that was easy enough. Oh, are you guys all going to line up single file for me? Ow! Um, he might be able to get a crit on me, but I'll have to play it a little risky. If you get a crit on me here, you deserve to win. Okay, good. Wow, look at that damage! Holy cow! Double kill! Uh-oh. 
You know, the, uh, the next enemy can, uh, attack Ava now. I might die. Yeah, I, I think I'm dead. Oh, no, I'm still alive! Okay, uh, but I do want to run. Run! <laughs> I forgot. Every time I kill one of those guys, I leave myself open to attack. Uh, yeah, that, that wasn't smart on my part. Ow! Okay, maybe I shouldn't have played it so risky. You got me on this one. Can I get out of there? Good thing they don't have any magic users. Okay, uh... Yeah, get out of there! Okay, first things first, let's heal up Ava. It must be one of the first times I've actually had to use a life spell instead of heal. Well, I've used it before, but... Alright, we're in good shape there. And, just in case I decide to use Nico again, let's get her healed up, too. At least I think that's a girl. I don't know. Looks like, kind of like one of those Zora people. But anyway, okay, so we got you there. So, yeah, I can one-shot him. With boost, that is. Yeah, it'd be kind of hard for Griffin to take him out, but... Oh, right, got it. But yeah, you saw that attack power boost you got. Like, what was it, 17? Yeah, that's really good. Okay, so... We got those guys. Hmm. Let's see if my... I was going to say, see if my evoker can knock them down to size. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, let's see. Okay, so we got... What are you? Wind? Okay. Let's bring out Sator. Let her go. Holy crap. Someone was asking me about the monsters here. It's she Bailey. If you... Or if one of the monsters of an evoker dies, do you just lose it permanently? And... Oh, I didn't mean to let you get the kill. Well, whatever. But yeah, I mean, would the monster be gone forever? And I think the answer is yes, but that's never happened to me before. Or an enemy that I've played against before. So, yeah, I don't really know. <laughs> okay, let's go with, uh, what is it, fire? Yeah, that ought to do. Can't get in close enough to blast it. That's okay. Besides, I probably wouldn't want to use my Tier 2 Elemental spells. Just because, uh... You know, I might one-shot the guy. Um, okay, let's see. Let's put you there. That ought to be good enough. Well, at least my Evoker can, uh... Get in some good hits. Oh, or maybe not. I don't want to use Sator, because I'd probably kill the guy if I did that. Let's just use a regular hit for now. Not bad, but uh, I'm gonna leave well enough alone. I think, uh, let's see. The Griffin can take care of that guy. Thank you for attacking the one person who I have an elemental advantage against. Okay, we can play it that way. No crit? Oh man. Yeah, can't go through the forest to get to uh, LaVail there. Okay, so let's move you. Well, I don't have to move you, but attack someone. There you go. Good job. Yeah, these guys give quite a bit of experience because we're actually fighting reasonably leveled enemies for a change. Um, let's see. Let's back off now. How are you doing? Took a little hit. Little hit. Little hit. Okay. Let's, uh, back off, and then I'll heal all of them. Start with Scrawl there. He might be able to contribute against those, uh, knights that they got. 
in fighters, the water ones. Although I'd prefer to let uh, my griffin take care of that. And uh, who is the other one who needed it? Oh, the griffin. You know, I think I'm going to heal Ava instead. Even though the griffin's lost more HP, he still has a lot more to begin with anyway. <laughs> so, yeah, monsters are just a beast. Might even be better than uh, my DPS characters. Someone was saying, H.C. Bailey, why not just use monsters instead of your uh, DPS characters? Because they seem to be able to hit just as hard as they can with... Uh, uh, what is it? Uh, with the skill shot, you know? And I wouldn't have to lose HP with the monsters. And that's somewhat true. I think I still like using the DPS characters because they can sort of manage their damage output or vary it depending on if I want to kill something or not or if I need that little extra boost to bypass like a fighter defending. Um, sure, let's go for it. Ava needs the experience anyway. You're not at max level yet? Oh, man. Okay, well, this one I'm not going to, uh... You know, I was going to say I'm not going to boost, but I do want to whittle her down the size. Even a crit wouldn't be able to kill her. Not bad, not bad. That's... Um... Oh! Ha ha! Um... Hmm. Okay, I'll go with the boost. Why not? Knock you down the size. Ow! Oh, I didn't expect to be able to one-shot him. I forgot he has the vestment. Oh! Uh. Wait a minute, was that just the one? Or... Oh, okay. So I did kill most of them. Yeah, there was just the one enemy there still left. Keep on killing the bosses too quickly. What do you mean? But I'm not gonna die. Uh-oh. Dead now. Well, we were already going to kill you anyway, but now we'll kill you even more slowly. Is that how you spell pleasantries? I think it is, but for some reason looking at it, it just seems a little off for some reason. Uh-oh. We can't take on a royal stone. Looks like it's all over for us. Can we survive the power of the Royal Stones? Find out next time on Let's Play Royal Stone. This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.